Hi everyone, welcome to Dridopedia. Today we are going to show you how to install or update any Goo phone or any uh, Chinese Android phone uh, which is based on an MTK processor. Uh, what you need is SP tool, the latest version is the better one. Then uh, any ROM which is for your phone so we can install it. And that ROM should be one that you can install through uh, SP tool. Uh, how you know that it is, uh, you can uh, install a ROM uh, through SP tool is uh, you will get one file called the scatter file which is in the .txt format so any ROM that contain that file can be installed through SP tool let's get started sorry for the flickering on the screen because this monitor is quite old so I'm getting this flickers I did not want to record my uh, session on a screen uh, because I wanted to show you how you should uh, use the phone uh, at this point your phone should be uh, turned off uh, then you have to just browse your scatter file over here navigate to the folder where you are you, you downloaded the ROM and there you will see this folder and uh, immediately after uh, enabling that one you will see that there, there are different uh, partitions of the phone uh, showing over here and on the uh, side you will see the processor and uh, there's a drop down which has, says download only so you will select that download only and uh, if you want to keep your settings and data you have to unselect uh, user data par partition which is here this one now just press download and turn on your phone once you will turn on your phone you will see the bars are processing and each partition will be installed on your phone obviously all the partitions uh, that you have selected will be formatted and uh, new files will be installed on that one that's why I said uh, you should unselect the user data for partition because if you will select this user data partition your uh, user data or the configuration and everything will be deleted or formatted and you will uh, get a new data partition for the user so it will be just like a new phone uh, is a factory reset with the updated or upgraded uh, ROM so once this will finish you will see the option uh, which will say OK which means your phone is uh, already upgraded or uh, updated then you, uh, you can just remove the cable and uh, turn on your phone Now you can see we have the indication that ROM has been installed. Now you can just turn on your phone and enjoy your new ROM. Here we are turning on our iPhone 10 clone. subscribe my channel for news reviews and uh, unboxing